Welcome to the closing event Empowering Youth Across ASEAN which also happens to the last event of the Cohort 2 program here at Prime Park Hotel Lombok in West Nusa Tenggara, Indonesia. So finally, I would like to once again congratulate all 75 young change makers and the representative of 10 CSOs for making it this far in the IA Cohort 2 journey. For those who may not know, the Empowering Youth Across ASEAN was first launched in 2016 before eventually we collaborated with ASEAN Publish in 2018. But before that, I would like to draw your attention to some of our special guests that we all have here in this room. from uh, any uh, ASEAN countries, from uh, Singapore. And the third one is uh, to strengthen ASEAN youth collaboration in developing sustainable agriculture business and practices. So we were based on that this project to give, a, to give an alternative. Uh, a week that's around 3,000 pesos in the Philippine peso. Second is weather, unfavorable weather conditions. All right, so we, moving on to our achievement, we highlighted five of them. And also we face challenges such as weather and also uh, natural disaster, the typhoon in Philippines. Postal, which will be the very shortcut and very easy for the youth and the farmer to follow and break this in the reality as well. Still uh, willing to join our project. 80% of them is farmers and there are 500 weavers families in there. Third, we form an effective ways to cover every individual's participation. So with that, we would like to introduce our program, the Sunny Kids. So the Sunny Kids teaches the art of wayang. So uh, we try to allocate uh, the, the time and we focus on the project implementation and sometimes we also forgot. We choose children here in Lombok area, especially in Sekotong area. For the sustainability plan, so what we did in our project is that we provide a small grant to the teacher. And uh, our beneficiaries is young people who have interest in uh, playing a board game, board game design, and uh, they are from high school to college students. In the journey to creating their own game for the Create On Me project, and 
at the same time, because the world was a very different place, people cannot go out to work at that time, a lot of graduates are out getting out there and people are also getting retrenched. And for the members of ASEAN Youth Volunteers we drew from IA, we do have uh, eight person in total. Prone in terms of um, communicable diseases and also waterborne diseases outbreak. And on the result of that is the Macy consultants can empower hurting the local population and holding projects is also make like relief effort uh, quite difficult. Like the picture shown uh, shows like trees going on the road and makes it like traversing quite difficult. Alright, thank you so much for all of you who joined virtually and see you in the next cohort. Thank you very much.